Hi friends, welcome to Training Stocks. Kindly subscribe to the channel for the latest market updates and also the multi-bagger tips. Please don't forget to press the bell icon while you subscribe to the channel so you receive all the notification what I am posting on my community tab. So usually the small updates I will provide in my community tab and also all our short time recommendations and also our multi-bagger recommendations are doing good and also you can see this post even the in the Sensex and Nifty are declining since last two three days due to the profit booking but still our channel members and also the subscribers are on profit so that is because of the fundamental we follow the fundamental in all the stock recommendations even including the short time recommendations we never entertain any gambling stocks that's only the reason even during this market decline and during the profit booking time all our shorts are performing well and currently we are going to discuss about PSU banks in last three Three days you can see this video in the last three days video I explained about PSU banks and I told that all the PSU banks are undervalued and also the privatization process are ongoing so on coming days on coming week we will come to know more details about the privatization and also after that the rally we may expect because the currently the silent rally is ongoing in all PSU banks even we are noticing we are not noticing that you and just you can see while three days before I was updated Indian Overseas Bank you can see here 21.45 but while we are coming here today it is trading at 21.75 gradually the stock is moving ahead even due, even when the entire index is declining you can see the reason also I explained very clearly that the public shareholding is very less in all PSU banks you can see here Indian Overseas Bank currently the shareholding pattern if we take promoter is government of India the central government of India and they are holding 96.38 percentage and also the public is having only 3.62 percentage even in my previous videos you can check that I very clearly I specified that there will be a huge demand is going to be happen to all PSU bank shares because the government they hold majority shares and with the public there is only limited share during the privatization there will be a huge demand is going to be happen and also the additional to that most of the PSU banks are performing well right now you can see the result all the PSU banks are given posted good result there is reason behind that and most of the banks are came out of the PCA PCA means prompt corrective action by RBI due to the non-performing asset now the non-performing asset of um, all the PSU banks that means the bad debits are getting reduced that's the reason it's coming out of the PCA framework of uh, RBI all these are beneficial Shell and only one bank is still remaining is Central Bank of India maybe we can expect the news maybe in coming days that Central Bank of India also will be out of PCA because the results are excellent since past few quarters you can see here in September 2021 that means the current quarter Q2 company posted 5783.29 crore sales out of that 250 crore profit company has been posted when compared to the last quarter was only 205 crore so the bank is on recovery stage and they are doing well right now when we compare and also you can see here 93.08 percentage government of India is holding and the public shareholding is 6.92 crore sorry 6.92 percentage so only limited shares are available with the public so there will be a huge demand which is going to be happen and you can see here that last quarter the insurance companies they increase the stake by 2.61 percentage and also the foreign institutional investors they increase the stake by 0 0.10 the same thing you can see here also foreign institutional investors they have increased increase the stake by 0.03 percentage in Indian Overseas Bank and also the UCO Bank also you can see here the revenue was good 31,000 sorry 3,719 crore sale has been posted out of that 205 crore profit has been made when we compare to the last quarter you can see here only 101 crore profit was there so you can see the profitability got increase the bar debits are getting reduced and most of the banks are came out of the RBI a prompt corrective action framework so all these are beneficial to the public sector banks so try to include all the public sector bank keep on accumulating whenever you have one keep on accumulating accumulating all the PSU banks 
like Central Bank of India, Indian Overseas Bank, UCO Bank currently it is trading at 14.46, Bank of India currently it is trading at 64.35, here also same scenario you can see here 9522 crore sale was made out of that 1050 crore profit has been made in this quarter the when we compare to the previous quarter quarter it was only 720 crore you can see the changes and also Punjab and Sindh Bank currently is trading at 17.95 here also the same scenario you can see here the sale got increased to 1740 crore and the profit is 218 crore when we compare to the last quarter it was only 173 crore you can see the clear cut rebound you can see here and the promoter holding also here 97.07 percentage i told very clearly that the public shareholding of all these psu banks which they are going to privatize are very less it's very minimal less than three percentage 2.93 percentage in psb bank so all these stocks will be with heavy demand in future Punjab National Bank so this is not in actually the privatization bus but when all these remaining banks like Central Bank of India Indian Overseas Bank Bank of India and Punjab and Sindh Bank these banks are moving ahead means along with that the UCO Bank Punjab and Sindh Bank the Union Bank all these banks will be moving ahead along with the other PSU banks because all the fundamental of all these stocks are good all these stocks are doing good right now and all the PSU banks are came out of the PCA framework so all these are the advantage and when we check the shareholding pattern of all the PSU banks under privatization consideration their shareholding patterns are excellent they have maintained above 95 percentage the government of India and less than 5 percentage with the public so make sure that you are holding all the PSU banks this will be a rare opportunity which you will get only in few occasions so try to utilize this and keep accumulating please don't take any PSU bank on short time swing try to make the investment on long time perspective and surely all the PSU banks will perform and it will give you multifold return so no need to worry as I told in my previous video I clearly I told the public sector banks the bill is the private session bill is going to be facilitated in this winter session in um, Lok Sabha so after that the privatization process will be started as everyone knows that the Air India already the privatization process has been completed and Tata Group has been taken and in this PSU bank privatization the major bank uh, major uh, NBFCs are involving like Bajaj Finance Limited, Bajaj uh, FinServe and also the government was clarified that the foreign institutional investors also can participate in PSU bank privatization all this will be beneficial and there will be huge investment a huge promoter will come and there will be fund infusion after the privatization all these banks those banks are getting privatized will make a clear cut rebound and those banks will be emerged as some leading banks so try to include all the PSU banks in your portfolio so once again thank you very much for watching this video whenever you have money try to accumulate all the PSU banks because currently it is on affordable price we are getting it on affordable price once a stock started moving means it will be very difficult to get it and try to avoid catching the train after leaving from the station so whenever the stay whenever the train stopping in the station try to enter into that and please wait patiently so you'll reach the destination for sure so the patience is most important in stock market so I know that there are many retail investors they have entered to PSU bank since long time and they are waiting but always Keep in mind that the right time we have to enter and right time we have to exit and hold only the certain shares which we should hold it because the wealth creator only we should hold the remaining shares we should take it either on short term perspective on the long term perspective but we should enter at the right time and we should enter at the we should exit at the right time otherwise we will lose money in stock market so this is a right time to enter to the PSU banks I am recommending since past 4-5 months and if you see the central bank of India I recommended at almost 13 level currently it is trading around 24 level so already we are almost in double almost above 70 75 percentage profit but still this is the right time to enter so you can accumulate the stock the all the PSU bank stock there will be a rally for sure keep accumulating it and don't forget to refer to the membership options from elite onwards you will get the access to 
Well played a stock series. The stock series contains of 50 videos. All these 50 videos are the premium stocks in the Indian stock market. These stocks will not be get crash even in case if there is a market crash and there will be rebound will happen immediately because all the fundamental of these stocks are excellent and the earlier low will not be touched on the next year. So it means the stock price will be gradually moving ahead. So create a watch list of all these 50 stocks and keep on accumulating like an SIP. So always try to maintain 40% of the portfolio with wealth creator stock this is to protect your capital and this will save you from any kind of market crash so try to refer to the membership options and these stocks are available from the members elite onwards so once again thank you very much for watching this video if you didn't subscribe to the channel kindly subscribe to the channel please don't forget to press the bell icon while you subscribe to the channel so you'll receive all the notification what i am posting on my community tab so thank you so much kindly stay tuned